This is Chris Biederman of the Sacramento Bee, and here are five players to watch when the 49ers host the Seattle Seahawks Week 15. Number one, safety Marcel Harris. The rookie six-round pick from Florida received the first starts of his career the past two games, including his first when the 49ers traveled to Seattle December 2nd. He missed a slew of tackles in that one, but rebounded with seven tackles, including two for loss during the victory over the Broncos on Sunday. Harris missed all of 2017 with the Gators after suffering an Achilles tear. And it looks like he has the makings of an intriguing depth player going forward. Number two, running back Matt Breida. Breida returned to practice this week after missing Sunday's win to rest his chronic ankle injury, which marked the first time he missed a game due to injury since he fractured his arm during his freshman year of high school in 2009. Breida needs to average 85 yards per game over the final three weeks to become San Francisco's first 1,000-yard running back since Frank Gore in 2014. Number three, cornerback Akella Witherspoon. After allowing six touchdowns in coverage during his first six games, Witherspoon has gone six straight without surrendering a touchdown, and he's allowed less than a 44% completion rate when targeted in each of the last four games, according to Pro Football Focus. Witherspoon's development is crucial for the 49ers in 2019 and beyond because they desperately need to solidify the position with Richard Sherman eventually nearing the end of his run on the opposite side of the field. Number four, tight end George Kittle. The second year pro has emerged as the 49ers most dynamic player on offense, breaking the single season record for receiving yards for a tight end in team history with his 210 yard performance against the Broncos last week. He enters the weekend with 1,103 yards on the season, second among all tight ends behind Kansas City's Travis Kelsey. There's no doubt San Francisco needs another all-around performance from Kittle if they want to give the Seahawks a run for their money while they battle for a playoff spot. Number 5. Quarterback Nick Mullins The former member of the practice squad has thrown for 746 yards the past two games, the most by a 49er signal caller since Steve Young had 761 consecutive contests in 1995. 300 of Mullins' yards came in the second half of the loss to the Seahawks earlier this month, with much of it coming after the route was on. At this point, Mullins has a real shot to displace C.J. Beathard as Jimmy Garoppolo's primary backup in 2019. I'm Chris Biederman.